and it is up for me. Unfortunately, the game is not capturing. I have to... One moment, please, ladies and gentlemen. We are engaging technical difficulties right now. Yeah, with, with Spelunky 2, I find that sometimes you have to, um... Window capture? Well, no. The weirdest thing is even after that, sometimes what you have to do is you have to go into the you have to go into the game and out again. well minimize the game go back into OBS it'll show up eventually you know go back and forth it's really weird some it sometimes it takes fiddling to get that one to show up but it does eventually well uh please forgive our fiddling ladies and gentlemen we will be with you in a moment but yes uh to anyone wondering why our we're doing this instead of a podcast it's because our schedule is changing. We will now be doing our regularly scheduled Paradox Hour on Saturdays, and we'll instead be doing other things throughout the week, including playing games like Spelunky 2. Which would be great if we could get it to capture, but we don't seem to be able to do that, so... Uh, let me open up OBS and see how mine No, no, excuse, uh, I'll just uh, fiddle with the settings a little bit. Go. As I said, this one's finicky for me too, but uh, it does work eventually. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh... Yeah, I, I, do have it, I do have it set on game capture, which does work, though, uh, as I said, I need to, uh, you open up the game, you have to go basically in and out of the game game between that and OBS a few times and it does show up in OBS eventually. No idea why it does that. Oh! There we are. Just gonna scale this properly. Oh. Well then. We're really, really experienced streamers, as you can tell. Just so professional. Well, I mean, come on. I don't change any settings. I just flip between things a couple times, and it and it starts working. So there's something we're with OBS also. And we're here. We're ready, and you guys ready to watch me die over and over and over again in Spelunky? Because I'm not. I am. I gotta, for like, more reasons, I have to go with Colin and eventually mod him in as a bear. Possibly a, a bear with a halo. For lore reasons. Alright, that's, we do this, and then we do... That's how you pick up. That is not how you pick up. That's oh 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 no. Oh no, flashbacks. And let's see how long it takes me to get past the tutorial. Probably way too long. Well, I think it takes all of us too long getting through the tutorial, eventually. Getting used to no auto-run is gonna be a bit tricky. I think you- I think you can change that setting. Yeah, but, like, I don't wanna risk having auto-run on and then, you know, dying horribly because of auto-run. I'm pretty sure everyone has already seen any everything there is to see for the Spelunky to tutorial, so I'm just gonna avoid belaboring the point. I I know for a fact that bombs are gonna be one of my biggest causes of death. I have bad enough spatial reasoning as is. 
Also, oh. is it really responsible to just, like, leave your child and just go to the moon? I feel like that's, like, negligence at best. Yeah, yeah, more or less, but I mean, think, in fiction, if we had more good parents, where would we be? That is true. Bad parents are kind of... Bad and or absent parents are kind of the... Fuel for the vast majority of fiction. Yeah, that's something I hadn't considered. We're probably going to be doing a lot of uh, trope discussion just throughout the course of playing the games as well, aren't we? Kind of on brand, isn't it? Oh yeah, it'll be on brand, of course. Still, nothing will be as on brand. Well, not even on brand, but let's let's just say the number of ways you'll die with bombs will surprise you enough to uh, beat that out. Good lord, she did. She really didn't get much from her dad, did she? Like, she is absolutely a carbon copy of her mother. There's also, like, a movie reference in... Yeah, well, I mean, the beard also, you know, gets away. Yeah, but she's basically just her mom, but mirrored. So I should note, I've never played a, a Spelunky game. Like, not... Oh, no. Eh. Not uh, Spelunky 1, not Spelunky Flash, not Spelunky HD, and certainly not Spelunky 2. However, I have... Oh, and I've immediately taken damage from a bat. I have, however, watched a lot of people play, and in true viewer... Fa in true internet fashion, have yelled at them for what I perceived as bad plays, which I am sure I will do much worse than now. Oh yeah, I, w I would like to tell everyone that I did have to say that showing showing everyone his first run was my idea. I'm gonna like this. Look, I just, I'm not good at video games. You can't hold this against me. I have terrible coordination and motor control. How do you throw diagonal? That was a legitimate Up question. throwing. Huh? Up when you're throwing. Ah! Well, there you have it, folks. Dead on 1-1. One, one. First run, ladies and gentlemen. I've already taken two hits. I really need to figure out spacing. Don't judge me for my inefficient bomb usage. And dead again. See, I told him. I told him that this would just be an exercise of me dying on 1-1 one, one repeatedly. Did he listen? No. Actually, I did listen. That's half the point. <sighs> This is what I have to deal with, folks. This is this is just it's just like that's m the whole point of me is to have the unpopular opinions and hot takes and just like be that guy. Hey, I'm my own. I'm my own that guy. Okay, seriously, I'm the one who's who just goes between silence and awkwardness. I mean, awkwardness is explainable. My stupidity defies human comprehension. This is gonna this is gonna end really badly. I, I know this is gonna end badly, but I'm taking the ghost pot. On second thoughts, I'm going to oh 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 You know what? No. No, not that. I'm just gonna like I'm turning auto run on. I, I, like, as an illustration of uh, the sheer uh, lack of 
movement control, uh, motor con fine motor control that I have, I literally cannot handle holding a button down while also moving. I literally cannot handle pressing two buttons at the same time. Oh, I hate moles. Oh god, I, I always get mad at the streamer for dying to moles, and I'm about to die to moles. Oh, oh no. Okay, uh, no, 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 okay, nope, 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 nope. I'm just gonna stand here and mash. I don't care. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna die to the ghost so many times. That said... Really? Okay, so... Uh, do you want the spoiler on this one? Uh... Which one? Which spoiler? And I'm dead. When you can and can't do damage. Oh, that I can figure out for myself, but, uh... Nope. Nope. Not gonna- <laughs> not even gonna engage with that! <laughs> not even gonna engage with that one! So, I have a lot of questions about, like, Splunky from a story standpoint. First off, assuming that this is a mystical wonder realm, they're dealing primarily in gold, right? Like when they go back home and liquidate their assets. I, I'm assuming that's how they afforded the rocket in the first place, as they liquidated their assets from Splunky well, 1. Yeah, that makes sense. This is... I'm starting to wonder if you're gonna make me hate Splunky by the end of this. It's just like... I hope not. Oh, I, I'm not going to, but I'm gonna want Because <laughs> it, it, like, I, I can already tell that this is gonna be an enjoyable... You know what? Yeah, it's just, just... Mm -mm -mm. Why did he drop it? Yeah, I can tell... Uh, I'm yeah, gonna... because you're balancing. Mm. But... Okay, well... Mm-hmm... Right, I may or may not be tilting. Torquey! I will ride the Torquey. Spider doesn't kill me first. Uh, so... Assuming that this operates on the... Uh, sort of... But the turkey was there. Look, I lack the necessary skill to properly engage with the turkeys. Okay, okay. We're tilting. I'm tilting. I will now attempt to stop tilting. I will fail to stop tilting, but I can try. Anyway, so they're introducing a lot of gold into the economy that was not previously there. Like, there's a surprisingly low amount of gold on an absolute level, and I feel like a big old uh, giant urn full of gold and jewels would probably like have all sorts of destabilizing effects on the economy. Have you ever thought about that? Why do you think a bar is worth five? Why do you think a bar is worth five hundred? That is a fair point, but it, like. I don't think we can apply that logic because, like, rubies and emeralds are worth, like, 2,000 a pop, and, like, on a, on a relative scale, they're not as valuable as gold. So, like, math doesn't, math doesn't quite add up there. But there's also more gold here screwing up the economy than gems screwing up the gem economy. Is there even a gem economy? Like, just in general, like... How... how does... Do you have any idea how economics works? I don't. What's, uh... What's alarming about the fact that I... Oh, I almost died there. And I almost died there! Okay, so what's alarming about the fact... Really? You know what?
right? I'm just gonna. Okay, of course I did the one thing that I was trying. Literally, I was trying to avoid. I was trying to avoid using a goddamn rope, but apparently that's not gonna be possible. Uh. So like, what's alarming about the fact that I don't know how the economy works is that I'm considering like majoring in political economy. You know what? Just take me. Well, just I take mean... me. Just, just take me. Well... Just end me. Well, I mean, come on. If... Come on. Think about the stock market. There's a lot of, there are a lot of theories, but I don't think any of them account for just the sheer amount of unprocessed dumb covering things. Well, it's not all. It's not all unprocessed dumb. A lot of it is unprocessed malice. You know what? I got to one two this time. That, I'll take that as a win. Woo! But, the sheer amount of, like, it's not dumb, really, is it? It's, there's a lot of malice in there, like a lot of, uh, bathroom dealings and under the table stuff. But, even accounting for all of that? Hang on, hang on, I'm gonna, oh, that was satisfying. Even accounting for all of that nonsense, it it feels like uh, well, it's established as a uh, that money as a concept is basically just a shared uh, shared fantasy, right? Like fiat money. Oh yeah, and of course, even how we value other things has a shared fantasy to it. Mm, yeah, like diamonds, for example, as one of the biggest examples. It's uh, absolutely a matter of artificial scarcity and the fact that like. In, for all practical terms, uh, also this is a very crate-rich uh, level, which I'm grateful for. Uh, it's not going to help since I'm going to die on this level anyway, but you know, it's a thought that counts. But yeah, um, diamonds and other gemstones are absolutely an artificial scarcity and like perceived value sort of thing, because uh, especially... Uh, Regular gemstones, even leaving aside the issue of diamonds, regular gems... <sighs> it's like, this is gonna be a stream of my... Oh, I thought you were referring to something. Unending failures. I thought you were referring to something. I thought you were referring to something else with the whole sigh. Get Getting on the admin, don't worry, gonna deal with that one. Yeah, uh... So... Gemstones, huh? Uh, why? Huh. So you can use iframes to super jump from using the Tomo flies, or the Tomo lizards. That's interesting, I was unaware of that. But, uh, basically, the whole shared fantasy makes even less sense with, uh, other gems. Like, diamonds I can sort of understand because it's a relatively, like, like, chemically interesting, right? Because, uh... Although, I guess that... So, basically, the thought I was gonna have is that, uh, diamond is chemically interesting because it's an element. It's just a form of elemental carbon. Whereas the other gems are more, like, mishmash hodgepodges of, uh... commonly occurring elements and things. But I feel like that actually makes more sense, because that means diamonds are a lot easier to manufa manufacture. Huh, just free paste, huh? If only I was, you know, capable of making use of that. By ever getting to a point where bombs become necessary. Really? Where's Monty? Uh... Also, what admin issues are happening? I, I actually have no idea. Uh, just one of the, um, wanna become famous things. Oh know. god, no. Oh god. Uh, do you have the permissions to deal with that? Not sure I have the permissions. Oh, I can just give myself the permission and then ban the guy. Uh, that's the spirit. Yeah, I'm, we're gonna need someone to mod this. Though, I mean, we could look at it as a kind of a positive. 
Yeah, right? This is the first time we've gotten a bot, isn't it? Uh, no, it isn't actually. Wait, really? Well, just take that away from me as well. Why don't you just? I don't even get the first bot milestone. Just repeated deaths on one one and occasionally one two. Why am I trying to kill that? I, I feel bad for these cavemen. They seem, they seem like they're just kind of trying to live their lives. But at the same time, they do attack on... Well! No, no, it's, it's not unprovoked at all. We're literally... You know, we're colonizers here to exploit their natural resources and cultural heritage and history. And also kill their gods. Kind of a... There's a, there's a we're the baddies scenario, isn't it? We do represent... It's best not to think about that. I mean, we do represent capitalism and imperialism in this game. I feel like that's kind of not the... Not the allegory Derek Yu was going for when he made the game, but like, you know, current events and all that, it's kind of a thing. So another thing, so in lore, correct me if I'm wrong, but in lore, they're like, each death is canon and they're like just dying over and over again. Right? Oh, uh, yeah. Huh. What would you recommend here? Just bombs or go for the power pack or just the freeze ray and try freeze and... Freeze ray! I'm a moron. I, uh... conflated the... pick up and... buy functions. I forgot that that was a separate thing. For a minute, I was thinking, oh my god, is he gonna try to kill the shopkeeper already? Don't do that. No, no, I, that was entirely... I think I have the wherewithal to make a decision like that. I can barely make the decision to, like... Do things. I do not have... Hmm. Okay, you know what? For simplicity's sake. Oh my god, I can't believe I managed that. Like, again, it's not exactly the highest skill maneuver, but as we've established, existing is a high skill maneuver for me. But yeah, I would have loved the freeze ray to use against the Sonic the Hedgehog, but, uh, you can't always have what you want. So I did the thing. So I, I really like uh, the streamer named Northern Lion. He really doesn't need any more promotion from a tiny platform like us, but he he's an avid player of Spelunky 2. He also has this habit of like constantly walking into pots after breaking them, even when... <sighs> you know what? Let's just go. Uh, who needs... Or HP. I, I also do the pot thing. I think everyone does the pot thing, except because uh, he's a much bigger streamer with an audience of, on average, like four or five thousand people. People yell at him more for the for when he does it. But I just realized that again, we are the bad guys in that scenario, aren't we? He is up here. Her eye, chest is up here for the eye. You know what? It could have been so much worse. Also, uh... Yas, please? Can I still afford that? I can almost afford that. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... You and eat you. 
I'm just gonna rope up here because I cannot be bothered. I'm just gonna... You know what? I think... I think this is a good investment. <laughs> Long term. At minimum, I'm, like, paying for one HP and potentially, like... A continuation of the run. Also, journal entry for the completionists! I, I do not have the necessary skill to be a completionist for this game. <laughs> like, even just on an absolute level, I don't think I'm, I'll ever really have the absolute skill necessary. But, you know, I can try. Well, I mean, there is a 50% achievement. Wait, there is? You know what? I can go... I can go for a, a, like, a bare pass. That'll, that'll be just like, uh, my entire university career, career so far. But I'm, but also, yeah, yeah, I laugh so I don't cry. Guy, one. Look, you're still one degree up on me. Really? Oh. For raising my voice, oh. I just sometimes uh, video games are. <laughs> don't speak. Oh, that was better than expected. Just don't don't speak to me. Don't speak. To me. My son ever again. Oh, okay. I mean, I still wish for April Fools they'd they'd actually do the joke that I uh, made on on the Twitter. That thing. Patch notes gave moles shotguns. I... If... If that happened and you were to bl blame for it, I don't think we could be friends anymore. Like, just... Just... I... I no. There's... Well, well... In my defense, it would only be a t for, like, one day. I hope. One day only is, like, six days too many. No! Mm -hmm. The worst part is that in situ situations like that, you can't even take the moles with you. I will say, um, I, I really like Splunky as a game. Like, conceptually, and uh, now that I'm playing it for the first time, for all that I'm complaining, it is fun. There's one design decision that I take issue with. Can you Which guess one? what it is? Um, it starts off with ball kicks? No, actually, I can live with that. Oh, this is gonna kill the dog, isn't it? It didn't kill the dog! Okay. Uh... No, my issue with it is the ghost, uh, timing. Like, I'm the kind of person- like, this- uh, this game seems designed to hard counter my general playstyle. Because I'm the kind of person that likes to be slow and methodical and, like, take my time through things. I don't like rushing. I don't like any game with a hard time limit, really. Uh, yeah, kind of hard to do that, that in Spelunky. Yeah. Well, luckily, they, they, did, they did bump up the time limit a lot between the original and this. Yeah, but it's still, like, only three minutes. <laughs> Like, you have three minutes per level, which seems like a lot to, like, people who are good at games, but to someone like me, it's it's kind of just... It's not enough. Like, I'm the kind of person who... who takes, like, five minutes to just, like... Don't speak to me. Well, I mean, did you you saw me play... play, uh... Fero and Claws, that was it, not Claws and Fero, right? You saw me play that. 
Well, yeah, but at the same time, there's a difference between that and a game that's, you know, actually good. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, like, for those of you who are wondering, uh, Logstar had a very respectable performance uh, in his first ever Cuso Grande entry. Uh, to those who are unaware of what that is, that is a tournament based on the Japanese concept of the Kusoge, which is, you know, crap games, to put it lightly. And it's a con it's a tournament based around playing really, really bad games and trying to do beat other people in them, whether by score attack or by, uh... Well, blind, also. So. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, that's one of the most important qualifiers, is that the games are necessarily blind playthroughs, because, you know, a lot of those games have... Why did I whip the dog? Now I just feel bad. Like, I know I'm probably gonna do it a lot once I... if I ever get the Kapala, if I ever get far enough to see two altars, or... Thank God the Ghost Pop did not break. Uh... But yeah, I... So yeah, uh, Logstar uh, competed in it uh, for the first time this year and made it to brackets. And in fact, uh, won a game in bra brackets as well. So congratulations to him. And if anyone watching, I mean, let's not kid ourselves. I don't think anyone is watching this right now other than us. But you know, if anyone watches the VOD, that's that could be something to check out. Uh, I believe... I believe the archive... <sighs> Monster, you wanna shill for Cuso Grande while I question my life choices? Or rather, shill for your specific performance in Cuso Grande well, I mean, while I question my life choices? I'm gonna be questioning my life choices either way, so... performance was, was a bit weird. Hmm? Well, my performance, I don't know if I'm going to shill for that one, but, you know. Well, you know what I mean, is just the fact that you were there, and, like, you sell yourself short. This is literally the first time you've ever competed. It was the first time you saw those games, and you still managed to get to through qualifiers, and, like, you're, all three of your bra bracket games were really, really close, and you almost had a few of them. The, the ones you lost, oh. you almost had them, so, you know... Well, either way, I'm Bro Senshi does the tournament. There were like 200 people in it last time, and uh, they, let's just say, they find depths of games that you would be surprised by. Would you like to talk about Yolanda? I feel oh, like yeah. that's, that's like a that's like a day that's like a daytime soap from like the. Mid 80s, I want to say. We need to talk about Yolanda. Yeah, that sounds about you, mid 80s, huh? Poss yeah, that would that would work actually. Probably, it's probably it's probably some sort of bad knockoff of Laverne Shirley. Which you know is in theme, considering what Yolanda is. What do you call a bad knockoff of an already terrible game? How did that thing not just kill me right there? Okay. 90% of the Steam library and almost all mobile games? Touché. That said, uh... You know what is still wild to me? Uh, uh, what? The sheer quantity of, uh, games on Steam. Like, the sheer quantity of, uh, cheap anti games on Steam. That. Sorry, uh, dying repeatedly does not make for good conversation. I apologize. The, the sheer quantity of cheap, uh,. Shovelware hentai games that are positively rated on Steam. Well, I mean, isn't uh, isn't 
porn a way to just add, like, a point to any rating? Well, yeah, but even with that in context, it's like, most of these games aren't even free or cheap. Like, a lot of these games are expensive and people still rate them highly. I'm, it's just like, you can just, like, there's plenty of it out there for free on the internet. You don't have to pay for it. <laughs> You certainly don't need to leave a good review of it for things that you can find through scrolling on, like, any number of... Also, I found a secret room. Derek. Oh, nice. Derek, please. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. Are you freaking kidding me? That's a real Derek you moment, as Northern Lion and his community like to call it. I love, uh, community and jokes. I'd love to be a uh, part of one someday. Also, with, um... That's what the kids are doing games. now, isn't it? They're referencing The Office? I have no idea what people are referencing. I'm pretty sure they're referencing The Office. But, uh, yeah, uh, just remember, just remember with me, though, you can talk about porn games, but I'm the guy who still thinks that maybe any given game I have needs, a. Uh, Special DLC. You oh, know, no, wink, so wink. that's a different. That's a different. Oh no 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 no, Monty 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 Monty. Oh, oh my sweet summer child. Okay, okay. It's fine. It's fine. The mean sloth totem can't get you here. Uh, now the only thing that can get you killed is me. So, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah. Um, the thing is, if you, it's one thing to like have a game and then add the naughty bits it's another thing for the game to be just naughty bits and no effort or mechanics whatsoever which is the ones i'm talking about like plenty of good games have like you know that sort of thing but the thing is they're generally like solid games mechanically speaking as well whereas with yeah uh, but i mean you can still mask failure with porn, and that'll probably be my approach. Well, yeah, but it's... it's I, The important thing in these cases is that you try, right? You wouldn't be making it for the purposes of being shovelware. You would be making an attempt to have it... Oh, oh, I see. It's just above jump height, isn't it? It's uh, not at all sadistic game design. Not at all. Not in any way whatsoever. So yeah, um, that's the thing is that, like, for the vast majority of these cases, they don't, like, try. I'm not gonna, I, I do not trust myself to place the bomb correctly for that ghost pot, so I'm just not gonna go for it. Well, except maybe at the end of the level. But yeah, uh... It really, uh, makes you think about the... Like, at the end of the day, um... Games are a product, right? They're a commodity. But it's it's one of those things... In that, general, yeah. That is, this is present in all art forms, really, because, uh... One place where it's particularly prevalent is, uh... Books, actually, strangely enough. There's... It's really, really easy to write cheap smut and then get it published on Amazon uh, on Kindle Unlimited. It's really, really laughably easy to the point that if not for the for personal ethics, I would like do it in a heartbeat to just like sheer quantity over quality, just churn stuff out there and eventually you get like enough sales to finance your real projects. The thing is though, what it's a it's a difficult difficult topic to reconcile, isn't it, isn't it? The uh where you draw the line between art and commodity when you have to make a living off of art. I think it's it's one of the most important things in the uh subjectivity versus objectivity of art discussion, isn't it? I think at least. Because Yes, a wor any work of art that is purely artistic is 
in its very nature uh, subjective. And to pass judgment on it is not necessarily fair. However, what do you do when you open it up to either public consumption, even for free, in which case it's not really, uh, it's not really purely subjective anymore, uh, because there are objective, uh, considerations like value and, uh, opportunity cost and things like that. So, that's one consideration, but the flip side of that is that is it still art? How do, where do you fall on that particular debate? I've done my best to avoid it. <laughs> I mean, that's certainly a valid stance on that matter, but, uh... Why so? Hello? Well, I mean... Uh, I mean gonna, uh, look, if you're gonna make me still... die over and over again, I'm gonna make you come face to face with uncomfortable realities about capitalism and creation. Well, I mean, I know the whole thing, but it's like when you get to Is It Art, you're starting to... You're starting to get into, oh god, I don't even know where to start or where to go with this. Like on a... I mean, if you want, we can just talk about how we hate philosophy, because I do. I really hate philosophical discussions just for the sake of having philosophical discussions. I, I, it... I don't know, every person who's into philosophy I've met... With very few exceptions, there's been a few decent people to talk to, but most of them have been, been really up their own butts about it. Oh no, I got an item. Well, yeah, there is, there is a bit about that. I mean, admittedly, I shouldn't talk because some of the things I like and my interpretations are just weird. Uh, you do have a bit of an artsy streak, yes. I mean, come on. You know, you know what yes, I know. Yes, I know what you're about. But I mean, you know one of my takes on, like, postmodern things, right? To be fair, your takes on postmodern things are actually, like, a pretty... <laughs> ironically enough, a pretty postmodern take on postmodernism. Oh, just so everyone knows, I look at people talking about... Talking about, interpreta about interpretation and deconstruction, and part of me is like, okay, so the, uh... So the basic idea is you're just dancing around the idea that we're all just a little full of shit. Yes, no, that's that's a very uh, postmodern sort of take on that subject. That said, it's true, but like, well, run. Forget the eye. You know what? Why am I going for things like the eye when I can't even? Also, my game is chugging. Does it normally chug this? You know what? That's fine. It's fine. Does it normally chug that much for you when uh, the ghost shows up? No, I, I'm, I'm getting basically 60 all the time. Well, let's just add that to the list of uh, reasons Derek U apparently hates me. Well, you are also running at 4K, right? I mean, I don't know how much of a difference that makes, because, like... I can turn down the re resolution, I suppose, but I, I don't... Can we get a... a tally added to the fuzzy dies to his own bombs counter, please? Well, look, at learning to cook bombs, uh, yeah, that's... That's gonna lead to a body count right there. Because, like, most people have that, uh, degree of, uh... Muscle memory, right? Because uh, from what I take it, the bomb cooking timings are similar between Lunky 1 and Lunky 2. Also, what time are we at right now? 44. Okay. Uh, let me know when we hit the hour so I can uh, stop dying and maybe play a game. And we can switch to Hypnospace Outlaw, which I might actually be able to, you know, function in. But, uh, what was 
I saying? What was I saying? Remind me what I was saying. I don't remember things. I have the short-term memory of an anemic goldfish. Does it does anemia Where's affect affect short-term memory? I just said that because I really like adding anemic as a as a qualifier to th as an adjective for describing things, but like I don't know if it actually holds here. Yeah, I don't. Th if you're using modifiers, I don't think it really matters that much if it's accurate. I mean, it could. It matters when you're like trying to actually tell a story, which you know. I would like to address the fact that despite the fact that we're named the Storytime Network, we're uh, kind of short on stories, and the reason for that is that stories kind of require an audience. <laughs> I'm just gonna like lay it out for you. Stories require an audience for the most part. Let's. Is. Hey, uh, do you know any, uh, reliable strats for killing Yang? I know no reliable strats for killing any of the, uh, any of the NPCs. Well, you can, uh, you can pretty reliably rope kill shopkeepers, right? I'm need... not sure if you can do that. Wait, did they pass that out? I have no idea. I haven't tried it. You know what? How do you double jump with the turkey? No, you can still do the double jump and then jump. Oh off. right, right. No, no, no. I was, I was uh, holding up. That's the problem. So for science, wow, that's a really hard piece of muscle memory to get rid of. I don't know if it works if you didn't have the muscle memory for the original method in the first place. I believe it goes a little something like this, and then you do this, and do that. That was pretty clean, right? I would clap, except I have to hit buttons on my keyboard to talk. Sorry. Again. You know, I I deserve that. I walked right into that one. But yeah, so apparently that's the most reliable method of uh, killing shopkeepers in Spelunky 2. Is you just uh, get them out of their little nook with uh, by picking up an item and then just uh, stun them with the rope and start blasting. That said, uh, what were we talking about? immediately beforehand hey I, I lost track of it when I was when I was seeing if it would work with the uh, shopkeeper wait are you in game as well like are you doing your own runs or no no I'm watching yours that's it I mean Right. Okay. Uh, I mean, if nothing else, uh, you can give me a decent uh, benchmark on how amusing it is to watch me fail repeatedly. Hey, I'm having fun with this. Life is pain. Oh, I was uh, hoping you'd just try running to the exit on that one personally. Oh, I tried. I failed, as we've established, is my... Failure is to me like, uh... Swimming is to dogs. It's not a constant state of existence, but it is, like, deeply ingrained within my soul and my genes. So, so just stepping back for a second, that was trying? Yes, that was me trying. I don't know what to tell you, I'm bad at games! I tried to warn and, you! And of all the things I could have said, that was probably the douchiest. I mean, it was also funny. I guess the thing is that sometimes 
the dickish thing to say is also the funniest thing to say in any given situation. Really. You know what? If I die, I die. Well, I died! <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna spend the next few restarts practicing this. Quality content here, folks. This is why you come to <laughs> Storytime Network. Oh, uh, uh, well, hey, I mean, you just have to love the fact that, uh, just the fact that the block wanted to emphasize things. Yeah, no, 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 yeah, no. It's just like, there's there's no kill like overkill. Oh, and now I'm poisoned. You know what? I was, try I was gonna try and take it with me by bombing it. I couldn't even do that. Or you know what? Uh, I'm calling the shot. I will kill the Tomo insert. Okay, that was sheer dumb luck. So let's see if I can kill the spider from here. Nope. Derek gives us four bombs at the start. I'm gonna use them. Oh, that was incorrect. Moving target. Let's go for a moving target. The bombs detonate on impact. Any chance you'll <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. That was. Could that you try was, getting? Uh, that could you try getting two one. Could you try getting two one before the uh before the hour. I want to see that. Eight minutes to two one. Uh, the things I do for entertainment value. Oh, hang on. This is a bad seed. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna quick restart until, I'm just gonna Isaac Strats it. Quick restarts until I get a good seed. I can live with this. Again, that was me trying. <laughs> Ignore the Torquey. Probably gonna come back to bite me eventually, but ignore the Torkels. Yeah, I'm not sure I'd recommend ignoring the Turkey though. Turkey is just oh. Ignore Turkey, spam bomb, and live your life. I'm just gonna toss a bomb down there just to see what. Huh! I mean, it's bad, but, huh. You know what? If that's how we're doing it, that's how we're doing it. Still there? Hello? Oh, uh, yeah. What do you think about me losing what remains of my sanity and trying to, like, do this as quickly as possible? Something up? Well, I mean, 1 3 is your record so far, right? Yeah, but like, let's be honest, the shopkeeper's gonna kill me at the end exit. Well, you do have 37 bombs to work with. That is a very good point. Uh, 
Oh, this is the worst possible. Never mind! Okay. Oh, I'm a. Oh, I hear the beating of drums! Luxor, I hear the beating of drums! Yes! The drums are. We'll see what happens to the drums. Oh, no, no, I, I've already watched up to 7 1, so you know. Oh, yeah, I know you know what to do. Oh, I don't know what to do, but I know what happens. I know what's going to be done to me. No, 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 no. I, I'm not dying to a bat. Not after coming this far. Or to a Tomo lizard. No one. Yeah, let's just, let's just do this. I don't need the bombs, I just need the H. Oh my god! Wilbach's dead! And I killed him! I, I think I'm gonna make it to... Huh! Oh. No, 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 no! Oh, oh god, oh no. Uh... Are you watching with bated breath, or are you just like, uh... Um, yeah, I'm, I'm watching like, come on, come on, come on. Hang on, just, just did Monty- Ah! Oh! I mean, you have to admit, I did manage a semi-decent, uh, shopkeeper kill on the, uh, on the- So, um, I may, may, it's possible my problem was that I just wasn't, uh, wasn't playing fast enough, huh? Well, goodbye, uh, to those Not pads. really. How do you explain the fact that I, I only well, I mean, managed to... Well, you were going for, you were going for 2-1 this time, and... If if this were Mystery Funhouse, I would throw you a tangible progress. Uh, make sacrifices. Look, I know I should have uh, sacked that thing, that dude. Uh, No, 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 no! <laughs> Derek! Derek, please. I, I think... Hey, 2-1. Furthest you've ever gotten. Also, we're at 59, so... Basically, yeah. Yeah. Uh... Well, that was Spelunky. I'm, uh, I'm just gonna change the game real quick while I, uh... Right back, folks. Uh, theoretically. Oh, there we go. The overlay's up. And I will also be right back. Just, just a minute. Meantime, I will figure out how to cap if Hypnospace Outlaw is going to be capturing. That's going to be our next game, by the way. Hypnospace Outlaw. I'm just going to have to yoink and uh, yoink and uh, hypnos. Hypnospace Outlaw done. And now we attempt to play the thing. And hopefully it works. Oh, this is...
This is a uh, Hypno Space Outlaw, huh? Yeah. Well, the sound is certainly working. Shall we see if we can? Oh, and there we go. Well, I'm certainly excited for this, considering the fact that, uh, uh, hold me. Uh, <laughs> help me. Um, and here we go. Hello? I've I've booted uh, yeah, uh, I'm in the BIOS? Yeah. Help me? Help? Yeah, you I, might want to get out. This is, just exit, just return to Hypnoes, you know. You don't need to do any of this. Okay, and I, I just panicked and This is a, this is a keyboard and mouse game, right? Yep. This isn't going to leak my IP or anything, is it? I don't think so. I mean, I didn't oh, notice anything like that. Moment, if, if it did, then I'm screwed. Make some adjustments to the, uh, the old volume mixer. I only know, uh, one thing about this game, and it's Granny, gr Granny Cream's hot butter ice cream. You take the hot butter, mix it with the ice cream. What's it? Fuzzy. Uh, uh, Fuzzy. Was it? Fuzzy. Some cool. You can see it on Fuzzy. your screen. But whatever. I, I don't remember all of it now. Mix it up. Cool. You can see it on your screen. Fuzzy. No, yeah. Okay. I think I get it. Fuzzy. Log star PLS. Ah, it doesn't do the plez. Okay, never mind. What, no password? I the super The future is you. Your passion. Your imagination, your hard work. And now, with the help of Hypnospace, you have the tools and the time to make it a reality. Witness the dawning of a new world, where sleep time is no longer downtime. It's where the future is built. A future built by you. I would unironically probably sign away my uh, freedom in a Welcome. techno dystopia for something like that. Patrol department enforcer training. Uh, I have the feeling eventually it'll be mandatory. Let's be honest. It will be, but like I can at least pretend I did it willingly. Hello, fuzzy. Thank you for volunteering to help keep our wonderful community of Hypnospace citizens safe. Hypno-S Enforcer Edition is different from the standard version of Hypno-S in several key areas. This tutorial will guide you through everything you need to know to best serve your fellow Hypnospace citizens and earn Hypnocoin along the way. Let's do this. Direct your attention to the top of your desktop, and you'll notice the Hypno-S info bar. From left to right, this handy toolkit features quick access to, to the settings menu, the quick switcher, 
the application menu, the current date and time, your HypnoCoin balance, the restart and log off buttons. Make sure to click the log off button to save your progress and safely exit HypnoS. The info bar may be repositioned anywhere along the top or bottom of your desktop. I feel like I'm back in 1999. Fun fact, 1999 was actually the uh, year I first used a computer. Huh. I was two years old at the time. Well, yeah, well, you, you know... Yeah, you know I'm an old. Yeah, yeah, no, no, I did. No, I'm not trying to make you feel bad about it. I'm just like so. Apparently, um, it was a really old. It was a Windows Win ninety five build with a like a little a G drive for games. And I, by games, I use the term very loosely. I mean like solitaire and like a little chess thing and a few like basically what are now fl considered flash games, that sort of thing. So apparently, before I learned how to even properly read, they did teach me the G stood for games, and I learned to recognize that, and I would just, like... I figured out how to turn the computer on on my own as a two-year-old fuzzy. Just, you said flash thing. You mean shockwave games? Yes, you know what I... You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I do. It's just like, yeah, Shockwave. I remember Shockwave. We also had some uh, bootleg DOS games. But I can't remember. There was this one Tom and Jerry one that was fiendishly difficult and also possibly like a borderline Metroidvania. So that's, that was a thing. I guess. Hippie, continuing. also known as yeah, the Hypnospace yeah, Intelligent Intermediary, is your digital helper. He'll notify you when you receive important Also 99, messages, though. And even my alert system, you to my connection was not updates. this fast in 99. Hippie I couldn't do like a 20 help. by 15 Here's a useful video. tip. Right click any text in Hypnospace and Hippie will read it out loud. Whether you're new to Hypnospace or Hypno a veteran citizen, citizen edition to you've tutorial. come to the right place. Our experienced guides will take you on a virtual tour through some Hippie Hippie is your digital helper. He'll notify you when you receive important messages. Up. Thank you for volunteering to help keep our wonderful community of Hypnospace citizens safe. Hypno S Enforcer Edition is different from the Chime is an easy way to remember the five types of violations that we'd like enforcers to keep an eye out for. C stands for content infringement, H is for harassment, I for illegal activity, M for malicious software, and E is for extra legal commerce. Find more information in the- Okay, can we just talk about the fact that this is just too real? Considering like YouTube and Twitch's uh, copyright stuff and DMCA oh, yeah. stuff and just like, this is too real. I is this one of those games where I'm going to question my life choices? I'm not sure. I'm not sure you're going to question them. The HSPD hand. I mean, to be fair, I mean, waking up in the morning makes me question my life choices. So you know, it's not that hard. Book. And let's be honest with some of the things they uh, let people get away with. I would say this would be like maybe. C-M-E or C-E in reality. is a special secure program that only our volunteer enforcers have access to. The inbox allows you to receive messages from MerchantSoft, Hypnospace, or HSPD dispatch agents. You may also receive automated communications from Hypnospace pages. Some messages come with files attached. Attached files will appear at the top of the Downloading message and look content. like this. Attached files will be downloaded to your HypnoS Download Manager. Wait. Wait, this takes place in a universe where it's illegal for disembodied skulls to smoke marijuana cigarettes while wearing a top hat? Good lord, it really is a dystopia. Really? 
not gonna give me anything on that one. Okay. I'm just... still trying to figure if it's more, the if it's like a yes or if it's a uh, cases you've accepted. Eh, you Most know, of your time or, will be like, spent there's on so many ways to take it. So many ways HFPD to parse it. Layers, you know. Agent. Cases are generated in response to complaints from Hypnospace citizens or leads from the Hypnospace. You know what? I'm just gonna have you be my uh, trip sitter. And the then... cases tab opens as a. And the version of Hypnospace Explorer you'll be using has been modified with an expanded search feature, enabling you to find unlisted pages by searching for the tags that they contain. Oh no! It's bad, Citizen McGee. Use the stamp system to keep track of which pages you visited. I thought he was executed in the wars. View the stamped page list to read the I, I was stamped gonna pages. Put a year there, but I forget what exactly what Hypno year. Spaces but... citizens place the pages they built in our themed zone communities. You will be given search I mean, and you've browsing got to place access sometime to between zones only if you've been assigned them AOL by a dispatch this, agent. So, you know, the timing's Your hard to set. Your assigned zones will be listed in the HSPD zone access. The citizen data dialog will show a citizen's name, age, place of residence, as Dude, well you're 55 you years old. You have better things to be doing than this using sunglass emojis. This only visible to HSPD enforcers or hypnospace but, like, security you know what's interesting, though? Well, I had... Your version of Hypnospace Explorer uh, has what's, also been what's modified it called? to include an enforcement tool. If you uh, spot text or images that appear to be in violation of Chime, uh, first, uh, click on the... Computers! Uh, computers. I had access to computers Once relatively early. Appears, Select but which what's interesting is that uh, I you didn't have access to the, the internet consistently until I was much older. So I kind of missed the entire the initial uh, internet era. After that, click right? on the, the, 90, uh, the late 90s if and mid-2000s. Uh, I missed the dot-com bubble, point. basically. And you'll be rewarded with Hypnocoin. The first one, right? Yeah. If a citizen has accrued four or more violation points, their account will become flaggable. Click the flag button at the top of any of the citizen's pages to alert Merchant Soft security team, and they'll promptly review the case to determine if further disciplinary action is necessary. Because you may be asked to report citizens engaged in harmful, malicious, or illegal activity, your former account will be temporarily deactivated. You may not send messages or other outgoing communications to HypnoS citizens for the duration of your volunteer service. Please browse the HSPD headquarters zone for more in-depth information on using HypnoS and... Welcome to Hypnospace Patrol Department Enforcer Training. All right. Important message received from Merchant Saw. Adrian and Dylan Merchant here. Co-creators of Hypnospace no, and no, no, stop. important message received from dispatch. Hello Fuzzy, welcome to the Hypnospace Patrol Department. That's all I needed to hear. Adrian Dillon Merchant here, co-creators of Hypnospace and founders of Merchantsoft. Wonder who that's based on. Personally, thank you for volunteering. I didn't volunteer, I was kind of just, you know, yeah, okay. Huh. Downloading Gooper screen. I... Huh. I wonder if... That seems kind of a little bit minkus, you know what I'm saying? Well, this yeah, is well, just cursed. Go and, yeah, check your downloads. Well, this is cursed. I love it. This is my new wallpaper. Oh, I can move this thing. Yes, you can move over there. This will be my new wallpaper. Hang on, I need a new sticky note.
just uh I'm just gonna keep that there just uh for future reference. Um Okay, yeah, the, on the first two I realized what wing was a euphemism for, and the the last two just made it a bit worse, but it still works. Wait, this is an interesting little uh, thought experiment. What do you think wing is a euphemism for? Do you really want me to say? Yeah, but you know that that's not my brand of humor. Yeah, well, still, I mean, just off of lard and pheromone tablets, I was thinking, it's got to be wing equals fisting. I'm sorry. Oh, you know, no, I see how how you how you figured that. Where does the Spanish paprika come in then? That that sounds like its own euphemism for the other people. Not everything is a euphemism, you know. But, but when you start with those two, I think it is. You know what? That's that's fair. Uh, where? How do I? I've immediately forgotten how to play this game, so I'm just gonna Google illegal. Just start clicking around. Come on, just click around. That's half the fun. Uh, hang on. How do I, how do I, oh, there's the search bar. How do I? Yes. Select. You gotta, yeah, just click on the guy, you know? Wait, can I do this multiple times? Oh my god. Yay. I mean, that's what you do, right? Hmm. You know what? Go all, all, all in. Oh, I think I may be driving this... I'm already playing this as the bad guy, aren't I? You've got hypno mail. Um, I don't think you've started that stage yet. Don't worry, you will. I'm just gonna flag her six times. I'm just gonna get this lady six times and then we can. Oh, I should have been reading the statuses uh, as they went. Important message received from dispatch. Look, I'll get to it later. I'm getting paid right now. God damn it, hippie. All right. Bye bye. We'll die now. Congratulations. All right. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I've I've done I've done a bad. Oh, I feel bad. I feel dirty. I f oh no, 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 no. No, no, no.
Oh no, no. Huh. You know what? At least, uh... Harassment! You know what? I can live with harassment. I, I, but, oh, uh, phrasing. Though. Phrasing. Uh, I can... To, no, you forgot. No, there's one thing you forgot, though. Go back to case one. Just this is the thing you the thing you didn't notice. What did I not notice? The fact that I had no need to. I don't know. Go low. No, look, look. Lower right. Lower right. Oh, I can close the case. Right. Okay. Wow, fuzzy. Great job removing that content infringement. I just. You know what gooped about describes uh how I feel about this Zane Rocks 14, huh? Look, 14-year-olds are mean. Okay? We can Where's my where uh how do you go to the whole profile thing? Where you uh, look up oh, wait, people's profile thing? Where you look up people's uh private information. Remember if I I'm trying to remember that one. <laughs> Actually, if you can go back in the uh, back in the uh, I'll route, first I'll case. see if I can see if I can figure it out. See if I can remember. There's a pizzazz menu. Can I turn the mouse trail up? No. Cancel. Okay. Uh, what can I buy with uh, my hypno coin? Hey, you'll find things along the way. Lots okay. of things along the way. Like, uh, Granny Cream's hot butter ice cream? Unfortunately, I, I don't think they transfer that in your sleep. Well, I can still, like, put the order in. I'm... speechless! I... I... I'm... I'm just... I... Can I... I... I, I can't even process this! How? How? Why? Because 15 in 1999, that's why. Counselor Ronnie reporting for duty. For duty. D -d -d -duty. Drugs make you pretty lame. Okay. Let's go back to this. Uh, figure out. Yeah, I, I think I think this page was added with the new update, so I have not seen that one. Either that, or I just missed it because I probably missed a lot. Okay, but how do I get this person's secret thingies? How do I steal your secrets? I do think, I think the little eye thing gives you information on him, but you know, otherwise you're just looking through a, otherwise you're mainly just looking through pages. You know, the eye next to the magnifying the search icon so oh i see hang on there we go oh there we go can i not go to his is this music gonna get us content id man it hasn't yet i think they're better with that than anything else 
they're it's they're not pulling Boise. what other I companies are. Where do I go for this? Because apparently he has... Well, I mean, basically you're just looking for things that you can just put down the hammer on, you know? Yeah, but like... I'm trying to find his secret page. Well, How? it'll. I, you're gonna have to look for that one because I don't. I don't remember a lot of these. Plus, I'm not gonna spoil most of it right now. It, it takes a lot of looking to find a lot of things, and and you still won't when you're done. Trust me. You know what? Mm -hmm. Okay, that gives me nothing of value. Right, I can just mute his music. Never mind, okay, I no longer have to listen to him. Guns? Question mark? Can I just, like, mute? Yes, I'll mute you. Hang on. Hmm. Just remember what you're looking for and just go through and see what you can pick out. <laughs> okay, you give me some hints at least, because, like, I... Well, basically, I mean, you're looking, you're looking for the harassment thing, right? Yes. Well, no, I don't want the... I don't care about the harassment thing at the moment. I'm trying to find his secrets. Yeah, if you're looking for his secrets, let's... Most of the time, what you're going to be doing, you'll find it along the way, if you do it all. Yeah, just put that on the list. Hmm. You know what? Okay, well, can't do that at the moment. Huh. You know what? I'm not going about this the right way. Oh, this is absolutely just, uh... He has absolutely just made this person up. There is not even a question. Hmm. What if... No, no, no. That's... that's not what I'm... Hmm. Wait, wait, wait. Can I just, like... I can't be this stupid, can I? Oh, no. I will... I will tell you... With everything I've seen, there's, like, no penalty for just, you know, for just, uh... Eating people? Everything you want. Well, apparently there is. Well, not so much a penalty as... Wait, is this the thing? Hmm. 
Okay, no. Well, I'm just gonna start clicking then. Yeah, you've got to dig through all their dig through all their pages and just keep going, you know. Well, I mean, don't just make sure they're ones that at least slightly make sense, you know, by some weird logic. I wish I didn't have to mute this every single time. You know what? I can't even click on the thing. Okay. How am I even bad at this? Right? Like... How am I bad at everything? Hmm. Yeah, I mean, you're looking for any other any other related pages, you're looking for anything. You know you can just like tell me what to do now, right? Cuz I am ready to give up. Well, I mean, well, I mean, anything, any, basically anything about anyone sucking is basically already going to get a flag. Because, you know, think about being really overzealous. Okay. Well, you know what? Why not just do this and frame an innocent person then? I don't know. So, just do that. Um... And we do that. Oh, hang on, hang on. Not updated yet, but maybe I will get a status update that suggests... Ah! I think I can vaguely understand. Oh, there's a lot of these, huh? I mean, if nothing else, I'm getting plenty of, uh, Dogecoin. I mean, uh, Hypnocoin. Is Dogecoin worth anything, or is it, like, still a meme? I think it, it does have value to it, but let's be honest, um, memes are basically par for the course for crypto, right? I mean, to a certain extent, like... People also use crypto to like do crimes. Hey guys. Oh, definitely. Tell me definitely. what my problem is. Wait, did I get any new messages or anything? No, this is just a side. I think this is a side one. I mean, remember you can also you can always flag people and of course on top of that you can still go back to a Zane and try a Seeing what other pages are around, or any other hints for secret pages, you know? Also, you remember I played this months ago? I do not remember chunks of it. Do you want to, like, just uh, consult the Oracle? Well, I mean, the thing is, first, just start, like... It's fun to just look through pa the pages also and get an idea, instead of just playing it straight. Just get an idea what it's all about. Sometimes just looking through those, you'll find the hints, right? Look through everyone else's pages, like, oh, here we are. Hmm. First of all, we can see... Huh. This dude is still doing his thing. You know what? I can get him for copyright infringement. Hmm. 
Really? How, how does he have the license for this music? Yeah, yeah, I don't know how that one works either. Okay, well, you know what? Uh, guns. Profanity. I feel like I'm being led on a wild goose chase. Well, I mean, remember, there's everything else. There's everything else to look at too. Trust me, this is not a game you play straight through. You have to do the exploration and all the side quests along the way. You are not gonna get through if you play it straight. Fine, but I don't want to close the case as well as the thing. And I would also recommend any... doing things like reading comics and other things that will make you sad. Hmm. Just have with the moments of sadness. Might as well read his goddamn comic then. Uh... Okay then. Yeah, yeah, this is supposed to just give you an idea of what you're looking at. Just remember, this is what you're looking at. I just get to know the characters because I I mean I basically I just want Zane to go to Juvie is the thing that I'm realizing. Well, I mean, then when it all works, you'll be even happier, right? When you finally get what you're looking for. Yeah, but I like the I like the Wait, this is an actual page, huh? Do I get paid for this, even though it's in the demo? I have no idea. Well, I apparently I do! Can I just, like, pay someone to do the investigation for me at this point? I feel like I can afford it. You don't know how much Hypnocoin is worth yet. Yeah, it'll just look through all of Teen Topia, start looking through, get to know your characters, get to know how all of them connect. I mean, that that's where the fun's going to come from, really. Oh, you know what? You're right. I'm I'm a moron. I'm really just a big dum dum. I you know, this is actually my problem. I tend to tunnel vision a lot. I mean, first I need to find, oh, you know what? I had a link to an uncached page the whole time and I just missed it completely. Hang on. Okay, yes, I'm... Please, just let me go. Huh. Okay. There we go. Oh my. Oh. There we go. There we go. It was staring me in the face, huh? Hmm. 
Uh, go read that little paragraph again. Uh, got game or way lame, yes, I get it. Oh, right, okay. You know? This is why I need a trip sitter, because I'm bad. Hmm. I mean... Okay. But, like... What? Harassment? Maybe? Okay, we are making tangible progress. Okay. Copyright, whatever year, Mystery Funhouse. I mean... Ah. Ah, yes. Yes, this is... We're getting them, boys. I am attempting to send you to Juvie. Yes, thank you. And get paid. Ha <laughs> ha! Of course you know who I am. Well, I mean, come on. Why would you stop here? Just keep going. Oh, no, no. I'm going to keep going. I'm absolutely going to get him like 900 flags. Like, did you know anyone like this in high school, or no? I think everyone did to some degree. I didn't- I was, uh... I was kind of, like, uh... Important message received from dispatch. Lucky enough that, uh... I didn't, I didn't, my high school was kind of not that kind of high school, in the sense that it was, it was a very, it was kind of a, one of the fancy high schools, you know what I'm saying? The ones where the students are like, they attempt to claim that the students are smarter, and, and it'll, I mean, the grade averages do kind of pan out, but overall it's kind of just, uh, eh. I just, I wonder if this is the best game or not for, uh, this sort of, for banter. Because this is, this seems like it's a game that you kind of, the game is the star of the show, not so much banter. Oh yeah, well, I mean, well, I mean, come on, there, there is the trip sit Porsche. I mean, come on, you know what I'm getting trip, trip sat on, so... Well, yeah, but, like, you'll at least be able to react to those. Downloading Kappa Cash. Well, I mean, you already have thoughts about Cory. Do I? Do I have thoughts about Cory? Because I'm not sure. Because I didn't actually read... You know what? That's funny. I didn't actually read any of the things ab about Cory. I probably should have done that, huh? Oh. Well, Zane also. You know. I figured you'd have, like, everybody at this moment. You'd be like, I hate all of you equally. Way to deal with that harassment. I don't know which one... Uh, You're a real hero, Fuzzy. I don't know which one Cory was. Is the Cory the guy who was doing the thing? <laughs> Well then. You know what? I'm...
okay, but like, what do I buy with it? That's a hamster, all right. You know what? I can barely manage a pet on my own. I think I'm, uh... I'm good for now. I see. I see. Right? Um. The problem is that just made me hungry. I wonder how few pixels it can take to make someone hungry. I mean, with me, not a lot. Also, huh. Also, I will give you the hint that stupidity is not a bad thing. If it's stupid, feel free to do it. I mean... While I'm at it, I might as well, you know? Really? Really? Okay. I feel like... I'm missing something. Am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. It feels like you should be able to report some of those somehow, but I'm not sure exactly where you do, like which link you do, or if you do at all. I mean, I guess what I can do is I can... Just... I mean, if we're gonna be stupid, I might download as well download... Professor Helper. Download the malware, right? It's it's strangely fun just looking for viruses. Let me just say that. Hello there. I am Professor Helper. <laughs> Professor Helper is always here for you. Professor Helper here, need some help? Here, try this! You are a winner! You win! Hey! Um, <laughs> just you. Yeah, I, um, yeah.
Again. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay. Here, try this! Okay. Let's look at your other friends, huh? Yeah, let's look at all your friends. Ha! Okay, th this is a really fun game. I'm just really, really, really bad at it. So, you know. We're, what are we at on time? Uh, 51, actually. So, you know, about 8 to go. Oh, we can, we can, well, yeah. uh... We can kill Professor Helper and Professor we'll figure it out. Here, ready to help! I mean, I love the soundtrack of this game. It can be a bit grating at times, but it's... Uh, it certainly strikes me as a fun game, all things considered. Hey, hey. seepage. Just seepage. Uh, is that a term I should know, or...? The... The band on Professor Zane's Helper page. Here. Oh, right, 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 okay. Great! I will also, I will also yeah. note that you, uh, missed one of the links. I can still go to his other... Did I? No, I... Oh, well, that's where I'm going now. Might as well do the completionist sort of deal. Now, I wonder... Oh, that's... that's trippy. Professor Helper. Professor Helper here, ready to help! Great! This should help you! Okay. Well... I can at least go to... You've got Hypnomail. Yes, I know. Uh, there we go. And then we can go here. Can I have this as extra legal commerce, please? So I can like get the downloader for fr the uninstaller for free. No. Okay. Well. Mostly, huh? Important message received from HS underscore citizen underscore 0068325B. Well, um, I, I don't think you have to buy it again. <laughs> no, but I figured might as well be, uh... Really? Huh. I, why do I feel like I'm not supposed to be seeing this? Huh. This is what we call plot. Huh. Important message received from Dylan. Hmm. I see. Important message received from Dispatch. I see. Uh, 
You know, might might need that sometime soon. And that actually doesn't change my original take on that list. Look, not ev sometimes a cigar is just a cigar, okay? <laughs> I have an opportunity to take a joke too far. Downloading Especially shock usually, image example. I I only do it part way. <laughs> See, I was under the impression that uh Wait, is everyone just evil? Is that is that the... is that the joke? Is everyone evil? Where's the joke? I don't know, the fact that it's like real life? But I'm... I can't believe Satan got a search result. Yes, yes, I get it. All right, good cases. We should probably close this particular case. Wow, Buzzy, looks like you're doing a great job at dealing with the bad guys. Hmm. Help. Shopping list for wing night. Lard. Paramount tablets. Missing link. Spanish paprika. Satan repellent. You've got hypno mail. Oh, good. Oh. Oh. You know what? This no, not yet, but soon. <laughs> Oh, I see. I'm supposed to wait for the chunks. Okay. Okay. So that's an LLA. Tup. <laughs> now I just need to wait for four and, uh... Wait, was four top or was three top? I don't remember the numbers for him. <laughs> Can 
Well, on that horrifying note, shall we log off of Hypnos Hypnos? Uh, I think it's about time for us to go anyway. But uh, I would like to thank everyone who showed up. If anyone is was here, uh, just just not the bots. Just, just not the bots. Yeah. yeah. They can go fuck themselves. The people who put them there can too. Uh, but yeah, thank you everyone for, you know, showing up. If you did, if you're watching the VOD, please hit us with a follow if you're willing. Uh, it was a fun stream today. Uh, you can find our regularly scheduled Paradox Hour on this channel Saturday uh, time to be announced, but... This is hopefully the start of a, basically a system of streaming these things regularly. You know, not just games, games, we can discuss things. Overall, it's just a, it, we're going to have a gay old time, as the kids are saying now. The days, wait, is it 2020 or 1920? What, what year is it? I know it's a 20. Well, I mean... I mean, bars are closed, you know, we're, they're, you know... Oh, I'm There's sorry, a global pandemic. Like, yeah, global... Yeah, Millions yeah, of people I'm, are dying. Uh, yeah. On the brink yeah, of war. Y yeah, but but then again, think... No, oh, no, no, because the war had ended at that point. Oh, yeah, depression, I forgot that. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, or, we are going through a global... Anyway, on that cheerful note, uh, thank you, everyone, for coming. Uh... And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.